Hello my beautiful people, welcome back to another video. I, if you can tell, I am so excited for today's video. This is probably my second favorite, okay, maybe, maybe tied with fall, but favorite time of the year. We are going to go Christmas decor shopping. I'm finally gonna take down all of my fall decor, set up my holiday Christmas decor. It is a beautiful, sunny, crisp, Technically it's still fall, it's not winter, there's no snow, but it's like zero degrees outside and it's like a beautiful crisp late fall day. And I'm so excited to finally start setting up my holiday decor. I typically hold off, I feel like I've chatted about this, until after Remembrance Day. So it's the weekend after Remembrance Day and I am finally ready to go shopping, pick up a few things that I need because obviously I have a little bit from my Christmas decor last year, but I feel like there's a few things that I just need to pick up. So first things first, I'm gonna go through like a little scroll through Pinterest and just kind of get some inspo. I've been loving the bows and ribbons and bringing that back because growing up, my mom always used ribbon as garland on our tree. So I love seeing that come back. And like to this day, she still does, but I wanna go through a little Pinterest scroll, find some inspo and just get into the holiday mood. Let's do that. Let's get this day and this holiday video started. I hope you guys enjoy. Merry Christmas, baby. Rain is coming out to play. Santa Claus is packing the presents Making sure you've been behaving okay Merry Christmas, honey All right, here's my quick little Christmas mood board. I'm in love with all of velvet, bows, and minimal colors this year. I feel like my tree in the last few years has been pretty minimal, but I still need a few things. A big thing I want to get is like the garland for a doorway and lots of ribbons. I have these little houses, which I loved. And then just like some more minimal decor, I feel like is a big thing and theme for my shopping this year. Here's the little holiday Christmas shopping outfit of the day. We got Skims bodysuit on, All Saints scarves, Stradivarius jacket, a Goldie jeans, and then my little Uggs. We're heading out. These are so pretty. Look at the tree candles. down this year there's not that much for decor that I'm actually liking so kind of a bust hunting for garlands and just like long strings of baubles everywhere and Michael's had some. I think I like these like snowball ones and these pearl ones and I want to get a like wreath kind of garland and hang that too but I think this is gonna come up. Last stop of the day is Home Sense round two hoping this one has something better. These snowflakes are cute but I also love the like knit style pillows. pillows right now. In general, I haven't really found much of what I wanted to get today. I found a few little things here and there. Michael's was the best, but pillows so far are missing. I did find a blanket that I really liked though, so. We're on the hunt for 
for a mid-sized, not like giant candle. Next up on the list, we are going to go and get these nails fixed and a little bit more in a holiday spirit, maybe something red or green. Merry Christmas, honey. Yeah. The snowman's dusting off his hat. Putting on the show for everybody. All right, I just finished up getting my nails. I got a little green rounded French, but we're heading home and calling it a night on the holiday-esque and decor. I'm a little exhausted from our full day of shopping. I think we'll decorate tomorrow. Happy Sunday, you guys. So it is decorating day. I'm so excited, but the first thing we're going to get to do is change my fall bed sheets and comforter over from obviously fall to my winter and Christmas ones. To give them a smile that lasts another year. Before we get into decorating, let's get into a little haul. First up, this isn't decor related, but I have two new kind of holiday Christmas PJ sets. The first one is from Skims. It's this really cute red tank top and then boxer short sets, especially because the Ulta just came out with the men's line. Like this would be so cute to match with your partner and I am obsessed. And then I also have this really cute set from Lavion Rose and their holiday PJs this year are just Stunning. I got this silk style PJ pants and shirt set and they have feathers on the ends of the legs and then feathers on the ends of the PJ sleeves. I'm obsessed. Look at these. So cute that I almost might like wear it to like a holiday party or something. Next up at H&M Home, I got two little Christmas tree candles. I thought these were so cute. I don't know if I'll actually end up lighting them, but even just as decor, they're really cute. H&M Home had a lot of other stuff as well. I also got some garlands this year because I really wanted to decorate one of the doorways just as like a cute little entryway. So I got this kind of like snowflake puffball thing. And then I also got a pearl garland. And then the last thing for like the garland situation, I got a bunch of different ribbons from Michaels and I think I'm going to both hang these and then also make them into little bows for the Christmas tree and then for the garland as well. I also picked up a new Christmas candle because I got the little one from Ikea last week, but this is a crushed candy cane and then it also just has a cute little topper which says joy and it smells so good, but also is like a good bigger candle for like a centerpiece. The next thing that I got is this little Christmas jar. It's just got Christmas trees and sleighs on it and I thought it would be really cute to put hot chocolate in. This is from HomeSense. I also saw a slightly taller one that I could have got to put like candy canes or stuff that I might go end up picking up, but this was really cute. And then I also picked up this little mini faux Christmas tree with some faux snow on it. I'm thinking once my doorway entryway is finished, I'll probably put this there just to have a little bit of Christmas decor on it. Also picked up a matching ceramic kind of green sparkly almost sparkly not really sparkly but this tree matches last year i got the same ceramic material like a deer and this matches perfectly so i'm excited to have just another matching piece for that i also picked up a christmas blanket because i thought this was so cute but also the green and white goes with the stockings that i bought last year and the pattern is also really similar but just like a cute christmas blanket and then the last thing is ornaments 
First up is this giant tube of just some plastic ones. And then I also picked up a few glass ones that were so pretty. They're just white and kind of green glitter. Clearly my theme is very neutrals, like white, golds, and greens. But that is the whole haul. So now it's time to grab yourself a cup of hot chocolate or a coffee or a tea, but just cozy up because we are going to decorate my entire apartment now. And I think we're gonna start with the tree. Merry Christmas, baby. The snow is laying to feed deep. Our dilemma right now is where I should put my Christmas tree because it could possibly go here. I brought up all of the Christmas decor that I previously had, but this could be a good place for it. Last year, I put it here because I didn't have this chair but I could move the chair over, move the mirror over, and get rid of the, the basket that's back there and put the tree here. So those are two options. I think that this might be a better idea, but I also would love to have it against the white wall. The snow is laying to feed deep. Now wish upon a fallen star So all your secret dreams can come true All right, 
I just made some little hot chocolates for Alan and I. I think we're gonna order dinner in and watch a Christmas movie. And it's perfect timing because it just got dark out. It's just past 5 p.m. So literally the literally when we started decorating, it couldn't have been more perfect timing. I'm also so happy with how this turned out. Like I bought all the garland stuff and ribbons and wasn't sure if I was going to like it or if it was going to hold and stay up but I just used little command hooks and it seems to be good so far. We'll see how well it holds up over time, but I love my theme this year. I think that the little turquoise, I think that the little, I think that the little turquoise bows go so well and go so well with like my chair and my furniture and I'm honestly just so happy with how everything turned out. The only thing that I haven't put out yet is my stockings I'm also um is my stockings and then I do have another little paper tree I'm also trying to figure out where I want to put this now that the tree now that the tree is here but I still need to find a place for my stockings and this little paper guy at some point I think maybe this might go in at the entryway once the entryway is all set up but for now but for now, I think I'm done decorating and I'm honestly just so happy with how everything turned out. Wait, you guys, wait, you guys, as I was cleaning up, obviously mess mayhem, but I just found two sets of little twinkle lights and I think I'm going to set them up here. Also, I did kind of rearrange this and I think that that looks a lot more filled and better, but I think I'm going to set up twinkle lights here so that this is like sparkly as well. I'm gonna end off today's video here. I really hope you guys enjoyed this little holiday reset, getting in the holiday mood, decorating, and I hope it inspires you to decorate a little bit as well. Maybe you're in the mood now to do some Christmas shopping or just get in more of the holiday spirit. But I love you guys so much and I will see you in the next video, which will be day one of Vlogmas. I have decided that I'm gonna try to do 12 days of Vlogmas. We'll see how it goes, I'm really excited. It's gonna be a lot of work, but it's gonna be a lot of fun. So stay tuned and get excited for December. But I love you guys so much and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. Thank you.